there are two types of Raspberry Pi compute model. The first, which has the light suffix in its name, doesn't have a built-in permanent memory on board. Thus, the operating system must be installed on a microSD card. That means the light model only works in conjunction with a microSD. But there is also a second type, the Raspberry Pi compute model 3 or 3 plus without the light suffix. It has a built-in permanent memory on board. In this case, it works without a microSD card since Linux is installed on its eMMC internal memory. Please note that Stereo Pi cannot work with microSD on non-light models since the same data, data lines are used for both the built-in eMMC memory and the microSD. That is, you will not be able to use non-light compute models with a microSD card. So, what needs to be done to install a Linux image onto a model with a built-in eMMC memory? First of all, install the model in the board and make sure that it's installed correctly. Second step, uh, there are two pins on the StereoPi board. They switch the board's boot mode. If you put a jumper on these pins, then you'll switch the board into eMMC boot mode. If you don't have a jumper, it's a standard computer jumper, then here's a little life hack for you. You can use the supplied additional power cable as a jumper. The distance between the connectors is uh, 2.54 millimeters, which makes the cable suitable for, for use uh, on these pins. And you can either quickly twist the wires, which of course is an ugly and rough solution, or solder them to quickly get a homemade jumper. The next step after installing the jumper is connecting to a computer. Take a micro USB cable and connect one end to the stereo pie and the other to the computer. The system will automatically turn on, regardless of the position of the power switch. When the stereo pie detects power input on the micro USB, it switches to a special boot mode. In this mode, two things happen. First, the system disables the USB and LAN hub on board, so USB and networking stop working. Second, if the jumper is installed, it switches the compute model from operating system boot mode to eMMC image flash mode. After getting StereoPi in this mode, run the RP boot utility on the computer. There is a link to download it on our wiki. And the computer will see the built-in eMMC memory as if it were a regular microSD card. Then use standard Raspbian flash, flash procedure, but instead of a microSD, you will be working with the built-in eMMC memory of your compute model. Finally, a small comment for advanced users. If you are not using a jumper on the stereo pie, with any type of model, light or non-light, installed on it, and you connect it to a computer and power it up through the micro USB connector, then firstly, the USB hub is disconnected and USB and networking stop working, and secondly, the compute modules USB contacts get directly routed to the micro USB. This way, if you enable USB gadget support on the stereo Pi, you could make your computer see it as an, for example, R&D network card. Previously, this mode was supported by only two Raspberry models. The Raspberry Pi model A and Raspberry Pi Zero. Now this mode is also supported by the new Raspberry Pi 4, since uh, it has an additional, additional USB-C hub on board that can work in client mode.